I'll uh, I'll uh, turn it over uh, to my my friend Dutch, and we'll get to the question. Okay. Well, thanks, Insa and Fran, for having us here. It's great to see everyone here involved in the intelligence community some way uh, to talk about issues that are so important. You know, what do we do in intelligence? I believe strongly that intelligence is the best defense against terrorism, against cyber attacks, a lot of the issues that we deal with. Uh, what the intelligence community is made up of people, and people are so important. And the people in the intelligence community clearly uh, are smart, they're focused, and they've also taken an oath uh, to, to maintain the confidentiality of information. Uh, I guess uh, Snowden didn't get that, but who, who knows. Uh, I think i talk a little bit about the committee because Mike has raised some of the issues. Uh, our committee, uh, we have the Senate and the House Intelligence Committees, as you know. Uh, for years, our committee uh, just wasn't doing the job that they needed to do. There was a lot of partisan politics. Uh, I think uh, David Ignatius from the Washington Post called our committee a snake pit. But when Mike and I took the leadership, we decided that the stakes were too high uh, we're, we were going to work together as a team, and, and that's what we've done. I tell this joke, he's heard it a hundred times. You know, um, Mike is a former FBI agent. I was a former investigative prosecutor. All good FBI agents must listen to the prosecutor, even if we're in the minority. So you know, I always remind him of that. But Mike and I, we disagree on things. We always have come to a resolution. And I think a lot of it has to do with respect, relationships, and trust. That's the way, really, you should live your life. Now, where are we? We have... Um, a lot of issues that we're dealing with, things are evolving. Uh, we're very concerned about the cyber issue. Uh, Mike and I uh, pulled together, we decided we had to do something about our cyber attacks and uh, we brought in uh, the, the all different groups. We brought the ACLU together, we brought the White House, we brought the business community to try to find a way to deal with the issue of cyber. Very important and we have to deal with that issue. We're getting attacked, as you know, every single day. A cyber Command estimated in the last three years, I think we've lost about $400 billion uh, from trade secrets and information uh, that mostly China, uh, but other countries are, are getting. You know the issue of terrorism uh, and how serious it is. Uh, it will go beyond our lifetime, I'm sure, and we have to continue uh, to use the best tools, do it legally, um, and find these individuals. I call it a needle in a haystack. The, the, uh, individuals that we're going after, the terrorists, the bad guys, they're the needle. And we have to find them and we have to make sure we stop them before they attack us. It's our highest priority in the United States and secondly, our allies. Very important issue and, and we have to be diligent in that regard. You have the China-Russia threat, the cyber attacks, the issues that are, that are, that are happening over there. These are things that are, that are evolving. So I can go on and on, like Mike uh, raised some of the issues. I think, Fran, it's better if I stop talking and we listen to you all so we can answer your questions. That's okay. Sure. Thank, thank you both.